Professor Mohamed Hassan, the president of the World Academy of Sciences, Professor Romain Murenzi, the executive director of the World Academy of Sciences, distinguished participants in the TWAS General Conference. It is indeed an honor for me to address you on the occasion of the World Academy of Sciences General Conference, an event which is always one of the highlights on the global science calendar. The World Academy of Sciences continues to be one of the most effective platforms which enable the voices of scientists from the global south to be heard in and influence international debates. At a time when global challenges such as the COVID-19 pandemic, food security and climate change require a more decisive contribution from science than ever, the timing of this general conference could not have been more appropriate. Within this context, the inclusion in the program of this ministerial session dedicated to the financing of frontier science, technology and innovation in order to achieve the sustainable development goals is certainly appropriate. In this regard, I would like to propose for discussion three recommendations and issues on how funding programs in the frontier sciences should be structured to better respond to the sustainable development goals. Firstly, whether it is in artificial intelligence, quantum computing, or big data, the focus should always be on critical societal challenges we need to solve. Programs should therefore not only be multidisciplinary, but should also be human-centric. Secondly, international cooperation in the frontier sciences should become more inclusive, paying specific attention to the development of capacities such as digital infrastructure, as well as human capabilities in the developing world. This is absolutely essential to unleash the full potential of frontier science. Thirdly, frontier science will only serve society if the appropriate regulatory and governance frameworks are in place. These again should be developed in an inclusive manner, responding to the concerns of developing countries in particular and the imperative that frontier science should eliminate and not further widen global inequalities. That frontier science, technology and innovation is a crucial role to play to achieve the sustainable development goals is beyond dispute. This will, however, require a concerted and inclusive effort sensitive to the concerns I've mentioned above. It is a mission in which the World Academy of Sciences must play a crucial role and for which you can count on South Africa's full support. I thank you.